Hi, I'm Anthony Simino. And I'm Michael Simino. And welcome to our final video of 2018. Michael, an interesting 2018? Has been a very interesting 2018, but I just quickly wanted to address the fact that I'm not wearing a tie for the first time in one of these videos. Um, I've succumbed to the pressure, but it is the festive season, so we're allowed to relax we'll a little bit. We'll be a little bit casual this, this month. That's right, yep. yeah. So coming into the end of the year, um, we'll probably just sort of give, give a bit of a wrap on both the, the sales and, and, and rental, rental fronts. Yep. Sales, I think it's been written about and spoken about on, on every media forum, um, you know, the challenges that, it, that it's thrown up. We've obviously experienced those, but at the same time, we don't tend to see how the buyers disappear completely over Christmas. Mm. They are still around. Um, and what's been really exciting, we've been able to, to launch a few properties and a few apartments in the last seven to 10 days. And then we'll also have some, some really cool apartments that'll be coming to the market in, in early January and, and, and to the middle of January as well. So we'll be open, we'll be working. Um, 22nd, 29th opens will be, will be still um, ran. So yeah, get in contact if you're if you're in the market looking to looking to do something. Yeah, yeah. With the rentals, as, as with it. rentals, so we'll be we'll be open the whole way through as well. Um, obviously, it's a pretty busy time of year for us. Um, we typically see um, vacancy rates increase at this time of year. We're currently sitting between two and three percent, which compared to what the rest of the market's doing, it seems compar comparatively pretty good. Um, I've heard vacancy rates as, as high as ten percent. Um, but it is a normal seasonal thing. So it's just something to keep in mind at this time of year that I suppose you need to make sure that you're on top of applications. So obviously we're processing them as quickly as we possibly can. So we appreciate the responses from owners and landlords as quickly as we can on those applications as we present them to you. Um, another thing to also consider at this time of year is you know, making sure the property is priced correctly. So make sure if you need to do a slight adjustment of five or $10 on the rental, it can have a big difference come time to lease it. Um, you know, it's surprising how you know dropping a property from $600 a week to $595 a week can quickly get at least within a couple of days. Mm. Um, and the last thing to really consider as well is odd lease terms. So one thing we always recommend at this time of year is rather than signing a six or a 12 month lease and seeing you know, yourself in the same position in 12 months time, consider signing a 13 or 14 month lease so that your tenant's in there until January or February next year, or sorry, of, of the following year. Uh, that means that the property falls becomes vacant in a busier time of year and there's a higher likelihood of being able to secure a tenant. Beautiful. Yeah. I just want to make one comment, just as we as you were sort of talking. When we started doing these videos, I think the first one was at the end of last year. That's right. Michael hated being on camera. <laughs> Didn't want to know about it. To the point now where you just won't be quiet won't, on won't camera. Stop. You just won't stop talking. <laughs> Like you've, just, you've basically taken over this whole video series. <laughs> it's just all about you now. Oh, so, I don't know about that. Oh, well. I'm not sure about that. But anyway, on that note, we just wanted to say thank you so much to everyone that's taken the time to, to watch these videos over 2018 um, and be a part of it. And we'll, we will continue these into 2019. Definitely. Um, so keep an eye out for the one that will be coming out in, I think, late January, early, early Feb. But um, thank you so much. And we want to wish you all a, a safe and, and happy holiday season. Merry Christmas. Hi everyone, I hope you're all well. Uh, it's been some time since I've actually come to you through video uh, and there's a number of reasons for that. I've been told a number of times that I've got a great head for radio. So, uh, but apart from that and more on a serious note, I wanted to come on and say thank you very much indeed for your support throughout 2018 and uh, looking forward to your continued support for 2019. Uh, I wanna wish each and every one of you a happy and Merry Christmas and a prosperous new year 2019. Also, I have uh, our team who I want to take this opportunity to say thank you to, who have given us great support and who have been there for you all the time as well. So a big thank you goes out to our team here at Inner Real Estate Next RE and they've actually got a message for you as well. Merry Christmas, everyone.